This is calculator question number three from the April 2019 SAT. College Board gives us two expressions and asks for y plus yz, which looks awkward, but it can be made easier. If we see that y plus yz equals y times 1 plus z, then y is x plus 1 half. 1 plus z is 2x minus. No, let's write it out. Y, 1 plus c is 1 plus 2x minus 3. So that's x plus 1 half 2x minus 2. There's a shortcut I'll show later, but I wanted to do the algebra first. And I could do FOIL with this. I guess I will. x times 2x is 2x squared. x times negative 2 is minus 2x. 1 half times 2x is 1x. And 1 half times negative 2 is negative 1. That simplifies to 2x squared minus x minus 1, which is choice A. Alternatively, if we notice that these all have different constants, we can evaluate y plus yz when x equals 0. So y of 0 equals 0 plus 1 half equals 1 half. z of 0 equals 0 minus 3 equals negative 3. So y plus yz equals 1 half plus 1 half of negative 3 is 1 half minus 3 halves equals negative 2 halves equals negative 1. The only expression that's equal to negative 1 when x is 0 of these choices is choice A. So if you have issues with the polynomial multiplication that I did, it may be easier to just substitute in 0 and see which answer choice matches. And if that's not enough to choose the answer, which sometimes happens, then try x equals 1. In any case, come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.